Donald Trump has over 17 million followers on Twitter. The president-elect often sends out news and other information through his Twitter account. Experts say this is a new way for politicians to communicate. Reporter Miranda Christian is live with more. Miranda. Trump's Twitter account is a hot topic in the media. His tweets will even sometimes call out the media, like this recent one that he just sent out a couple days ago. It says CNN is reporting fake news. This tweet is just one of many that experts say is outside the norm of what the president of the United States usually tweets. Trump has been more raw, some would say more authentic, but certainly more controversial. The future president of the United States has his own way of communicating. He keeps his name in the news cycle through Twitter, and that's been very effective. Tweets that have caused viral discussion, from saying there was serious voter fraud this election, to calling for flag burners to be arrested, and recently bringing up how catching hackers is hard to do. He tends to be a little freewheeling and loose with the way he tweets, and I, I, again, I think as president-elect, we've never seen anything like this before. University of Nebraska Omaha professor of communications Jeremy Lipschultz says Trump's tweeting is nothing new, and Trump has built a brand for himself over the past several years. I think it's more strategic than people give Donald Trump credit for in this case, because I really think he used it effectively and continues to to go around the traditional media gatekeepers. On TweetDeck, if you look at the number of Trump mentions, the cycle is endless. Is that normal, cycling through that much and mentioned that much? It's unusual. I mean, I think it's, it's you'd have to go to the top entertainers, a Taylor Swift, someone like that, to see that level, that volume of conversation. For those who follow the president-elect, they are mixed on his Twitter persona. It's a little, professional and if he is I mean if you look at the tweets of say like Barack Obama or other previous presidents they are of a lot more professional nature everyone expresses themselves on Twitter so I mean he's just making it for the younger generation to see everything is what I think and everyone is waiting to see will the rhetoric continue after January 20th now the challenge becomes as a president naturally has to kind of tone down the rhetoric how does he do that and maintain his authentic voice? That's the social media challenge for him. I have a whole interview with Pro Professor Lipschultz about Trump's tweeting. That extended interview can be found on our website, KMTV.com. Reporting live, I'm Miranda Christian, KMTV Action 3 News.